first of all, love how flattering it's made my tummy look. I feel like this is an actual swimsuit that you could swim in versus one that you could bathe in. When you pop on swimsuits or any clothing for that matter from cheap sites, occasionally it will like snap. Like you'll hear a cracking of the seams. <sighs> no. <laughs> this one feels a lot more sturdy, like it's not gonna come off my shoulders. I freaking love these. I'm really excited about this. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Kay if you're new here, and I make fashion videos for plus size women. And I also do fun shop with me. So if you guys enjoy that kind of content, then make sure you go down and subscribe below. Today we are reviewing Cupshe, which is an affordable swimwear brand. Luckily in Queensland we can really wear swimwear all year round, maybe bar one or two months, <laughs> but in Queensland it is very humid and hot. So when Cupshe reached out to me to collaborate with them, I jumped at the chance because their stuff looks incredible. Like I said, it's all very affordable and the pieces do look good quality. So I'm gonna be interested to see what the model looks like and then what I look like when I'm wearing it. So I will be putting pictures as we go along. So like I said, today's video is sponsored by Cupshe, but as always, my opinion is my own. That is the number one thing that I check with every single brand before I ever agree to a collaboration is if I can be honest in my review. So thankfully they have agreed to that and we will be getting straight into it. I'm gonna open up the bag and see what they've sent me. So I ended up picking a number of different items and they sort of then just selected from those what to send to me. So it's gonna be a bit of a surprise for us all. So I got a size one X in all of the swimsuits. So it'll be interesting to see how the sizing varies and the cup sizes and all that sort of stuff with the different styles. I did try to pick a few different styles so that different people might, I don't know, I feel like some people like bikinis, some people like full swim pieces, full swim pieces, full swimsuits. Um, so let's get into it. This is the first item pulled out. It is a bit of a shame that plastic is used. Um, I'm not gonna lie, I do feel like maybe it's not necessary um, since it was all sent in the big bag, but I do understand from a business perspective they want it to look really pretty and chic and cute. Um, I have to say the branding is very nice. It's very like botanical and cute. Um, so this one is a olive green. The quality, first off, feels really good. Oh wow, okay, that looks good. It's got like a halter neck, which is adjustable. And then it's got built-in cups. Wow, really impressed with that quality so far. It's double lines, so it's got the white on the inside and then the, br uh, the brown, the green on the outside. And there's no seams coming loose. It's got a slit here where the boobs cleavages. Um, yeah, I feel like I can't really talk much more about it. There's ruching and stuff on the sides, but I feel like it's just going to be one of those things where you're going to be able to see and get more of an idea of it once it's on. So let's pop it on. First of all, I love how flattering it's made my tummy look. Like there's no real lumps or bumps. The material itself, because it's so shiny and I feel like that's quite flattering the metallic kind of material. So I'm looking at the viewfinder because that's kind of where I'm gauging how it looks to you guys. Um, but yeah, I don't know. I feel like personally, because I've breastfed, this is just not overly flattering on me as a body shape. Um, but in saying that, I wouldn't not wear this. Um, it's just one of those ones where I'm like, yeah, it's probably not gonna... I don't know, like I, I I just feel like personally my boobs hang in, you know? Um, and then the coverage on the sides, I think my boobs are just a little bit too big for this to be honest. I would personally prefer to have a little bit more side coverage, but then that's not, I guess, stylish. I don't really know. Um, yeah, the quality is good for the price. It's no $100 swimsuit, but the quality is really good for the price. I just personally feel like this style is not the one for me. Um, looking at the back, it does cover those love handles, which is right, really good. It does feel a little loose, I think. Well, this is where it's hard because I feel like I would size down if I could, but then the cup area would be smaller and I don't think 
that I could deal with that. Next up, again, they're all gonna be in this packaging, which, again, I really don't like. Um, but anyway, the actual product inside, again, feels really good quality. It was a 1X, and it's got this gorgeous flamingo print. Again, feels amazing quality. It looks as though it's gonna be quite full coverage up the top, which is really important for some people. Um, some people meaning me. <laughs> let's just, let's just stop talking and chuck this one on. Okay. This one is a winner. The only thing that I'm just gonna knock out the bad thing first so then we can talk about all the good. Um, this one comes a little lower than where my actual waistline is. So that's my waistline. I wish that it had an inch, maybe a centimeter more because if I pull it up, <laughs> the front comes down. So yeah, I don't know. I mean, you guys can tell me, it might look a bit different on camera, like it might look more flattering the way that they've done it, but personally the way that it's sitting and feeling on me, it feels like it needs to just be up there where the line ends. But now that we've got that out the way, I feel like this is an actual swimsuit that you could swim in versus one that you could bathe in, if that makes sense. Um, so the comfortability of this is really good. It's got really wide straps that go the whole way around, there's no adjustability in it, but that's perfect because you don't, well, I personally don't love that in a swimsuit. It's very, very comfortable. This is definitely my size. Um, I love the pattern on it. I like that it's black up top, very chic, and there's no, like you'll see here, it cross crisscrosses over like that, but there's actually no opening, which means that your boobs are not gonna fall out of it really really rate this okay this one looks super duper cute it's got this like seashelly is it seashells i feel like that's what it was called let me see so this one looks like a mermaid tail pattern and then it's got this gorgeous retro version in an orange and then this other kind of pattern too which does go really well all together but it looks like if i was to look at these two individuals sorry my square my, my square my chair's squeaking um, if I was to look at these two patterns separately, I would not think that they go together. But then from afar, it looks really gorgeous. So I'm excited to see that. And then the detailing at the back has this crisscross double stra strap, string, <laughs> strap. And they're not too thin, like, because they're right next to each other. I feel like that's going to be actually quite good. It's got adjustable straps. Yeah, so far so good. I mean, again, won't really know until we pop it on what I think, but um, let's chuck this bad boy on. Okay, guys, two in a row, I'm obsessed. So this one is really nice. When you pop on swimsuits or any clothing for that matter from cheap sites, occasionally it will like snap, like you'll hear a cracking of the seams, um, but this did not happen. So I'm really, really stoked. It's very comfortable, sits nice and high. It doesn't show too much cleavage, but just enough, in my opinion. Some people might find that a little bit too much, but I personally really like that. It's, again, removable um, nipple pads, but I've left them in for the sake of the video. I really like it. I think it's very flattering. It shows just enough of the bum, but not too much. And a really nice white, wide belt around here to make it very flattering. And again, high back with the adjustable straps. I'm obsessed. Really, really love this one. Oh, yes. Okay. I have my doubts, Cupshe, but I'm being very, very impressed. Another green, because green is very in for me right now. I'm absolutely loving these tones. The other one I feel like was a little bit more um, shiny metallic green, whereas this one is more of an olive matte green and it's a different shape so it's a full one piece with this frilly I absolutely love the look of this this is just divine um yeah like this frilly top this one has a bit of a smell as I've opened the package it does smell a bit cheaper quality the other ones haven't had that odor so far so that's interesting um it's got the ruching on the sides but again quality feels amazing uh, the straps at the back look as though they tie up. Yeah, I really like the look of this one. It's got a hole in the back, so your lower back is out there. And it looks like it's really well made again. Structure is good. No loose threads. No. <laughs> 
I don't know. You guys can tell me in the comments what you think, but I think it's far too breasty for me. Again, it might just be the fact that I'm a breastfeeding mama um, or breastfed my kids. Um, it might suit someone with a little less boobs than me. <laughs> <laughs> but personally, it's just too showy. It's, it doesn't look chic like it does on the model. I don't know. And then there's also no adjustability in these straps. And it feels like it's just going to flop and like pull off. So it's not one of those swimsuits that you could go actually swimming in. I don't know. The quality is really good, which is really a shame that it doesn't fit right. Because I really like the quality. But yeah, just not... The back's really comfortable actually, really love that design and um, it feels like sturdy at the back. It's just the front that's the issue. If it sort of ended a little bit like that, that would be cute and then off the shoulders ever so slightly. Like that, that would be really cute and I'd be all for that but I feel like it just, it's just a no. I'm gonna go and change. Now we have this really bright blue swimsuit. I think it's a one piece from memory. Oh yeah, this is nice. I'm loving that color actually. I was a bit nervous for this one, but it's really nice in person. I was thinking it might be quite bright, but the model made it look really good, so it sold me. But I'm like, actually, I think this color might look all right on me. I don't know, maybe I'm just being a bit optimistic. It's really good quality again. The sleeves are nice and like loose and what's the word? They're not stiff, which is the most important part um, for me anyway. It does look as though it's going to have like a low boob cut line. But I mean, I saw that on the website anyway, so I half expected it, but I'm not sure how my boobs are gonna go in that. Okay, I just can't wait anymore. Let's go chuck this one on. Fifth one, similar issue to last time. What I will say though, is this one feels a lot more sturdy, like it's not gonna come off my shoulders. So this one I would definitely recommend over the other one. Um, it's very similar shape in the back as what it is in the front. Also, absolutely love the color, might I add. Just again, it's really low and on me personally, I don't have very flattering boobs for this cut. But it's nothing to do with the swimsuit. It's just some th some like clothes fit you well and some don't. And this particular swim piece just is not for me and my body shape. It doesn't. It's nothing against the actual swimwear itself. Um, it's just unfortunately on me and my boobs. Just doesn't work. And last but certainly not least, this is potentially the one that I was most excited for. Because when I saw that they put the order through I was looking to see if they put this one in the order it is a two-piece so this one's a bikini and it is a navy blue bottom looks as though it's semi high rise it might be mid rise actually no oh, it's hard to tell until it's on again like you don't know how cheeky it's going to be it's got the ruching on the sides which is very flattering for someone who has a belly such as myself and then the top I'm, not, I'm so unsure how this is working what Okay, so I think it crisscrosses at the back, yes. So it's a crop top and it's got this beautiful design. Like, can we see that? That is gorgeous. And again, quality is there. The cups on the inside are definitely not like, oh, what's the word? Like it's not seamed in. So I'm wondering if you can pull the cup out if you don't want it. Let me just have a look if you can. Yeah, so you can pull the cups out if you don't like cups in there, which I think is really quite good because honestly, I personally prefer no cups. However, it does depend how the particular swimsuit looks and sits on me. So let's go pop this one on. I'm really excited about this. Yay, we're ending on a positive note. I freaking love these. Like, hands down, would go out and buy. The quality of the pants, phenomenal. But not me, not love, love, love them so much. Very comfortable. Sizing has been very consistent throughout, I might add as well. Um, but the top just fits me perfectly. I don't feel like I'm coming out anywhere. It's very, very, very comfortable. And at the back, it's got the adjustable straps. So again, like I said, if your chest is maybe bigger or smaller, you can adjust that. Also love the look of it as well, like the crisscross really, really looks nice. And then the ribbon matches the pants in colour. 
Love the design up here. I'm obsessed with this piece, you guys. If there's one thing in this haul that you need to get, it is this. Absolutely love, love, love it. Okay, let's talk. <laughs> so, my overall opinion on Cupshe is a good one. It is cakey approved. I feel like half half in terms of style. There was three that I would buy myself. So there was this one and then there was the mermaid one and the black flamingo one. I was like, where is it? <laughs> so those three I would purchase myself. I feel like the other ones, all of them were good quality, but just some of the styles suited me less than others. But that happens when I go to another shop anyway. So if I was to pop into any swimwear shop or any clothing store for that matter, some pieces suit you and some pieces don't. That's just what life is. It's just what fashion and style is. It's just to your taste. Um, so personally, I would recommend Cupshe if you're on a budget. Like obviously you get what you pay for. It is an affordable swimwear brand, but I have absolutely no qualms with today's pieces. Like there was no loose threads. There was absolutely no issues in terms of putting it on and it cracking like some cheap swimwear does. Um, so overall, very impressed, Cupshe. Very, very impressed. Let me know if you've tried Cupshe down in the comments below. I would love to hear your feedback, as I'm sure so many other women on this platform would as well. Um, also, don't forget to join the family by hitting the red button down below, and I will see you guys in the very near future for another video. Bye!